There she blows! On this episode of 5 Minutes to Burn, we're going to feature Moby Dick, which you can find over at miniclip.com. When you first start this game, you might think to yourself, Yeah! An Echo the Dolphin port! Nay, says I. In Moby Dick, you have to eat, eat, eat your way into existence. You have three bars at the top of the screen that you must keep an eye on at all times. Health will go down as you are attacked, and the only way to replenish it is to eat or find a health icon at the bottom of the ocean. The air bar you fill up by returning to the surface, and the hunger bar you fill, well, by, you know, eating. This game starts you off with 150 health and battling easy small boats. They are fairly easy to topple over and eat. The more you eat, the more your health bar increases. The more your health bar increases, the larger you become. You are given a boost ability to help you either catch up to faster fish or fly out of the water to crush ships. Be careful of the larger ships you come across at the beginning of the game. I recommend staying low at the bottom of the ocean until they pass. It will be much easier to destroy them later on in the game when you weigh a lot more. There are a lot of little achievements you can get in this game. Combo ones, advancing ones. I wasn't overall too impressed with the achievements in this game. As you get larger and larger, the whale actually gets harder to control and harder to feed properly. What used to be a great dinner now becomes a small snack. True, it is easier to topple the larger ships, but you become a larger target for arrows and nets. This game is a true 5 minutes to burn and has no redeeming qualities to make you keep coming back for more. Next up on 5 minutes to burn, we found the droids you were looking for.